Hey, what is up guys? Y'all from Magic Tech Review and in today's video we're going to talk about DirecTV Now going up by $5 starting at the end of the month. Uh, go ahead and leave a like on the video if you enjoy my content. Go ahead and subscribe to become part of the Magic Tech Review family and comment down below what you think about this topic or any other, to any other topic. Let's go ahead and get right into this bologna sandwich that we got going on. guys so speaking about direct tv you know direct tv and cricket have had a partnership they basically pump it out in all their stores as soon as you walk into cricket wireless you're basically bombarded with direct tv advertising i remember when i was working for cricket wireless i used to have to sell uh you know direct tv and, and, you know if you didn't offer it forget about it you might as well just quit your job but anyways that's neither here nor there so direct tv now usually Starts at $35, or you can get a package for $50, $60, or $70. Uh, they're named Live a Little, Just Right, Go Big, and Gotta Have It. Okay, so apparently, starting July 26th, uh, the price is going to go up by $5. So it's just going to go up by $5, you know, and they they had this merger going on, and they were talking about how you know, the prices are going to go down and they're going to be more competitive. Just like Sprint and T-Mobile say that their prices are going to go down. Now that AT&T has acquired this whole direct TV thing and they've acquired more stations and they've acquired more assets, they're going to ride, ride, uh, raise the price, right? So as if it wasn't already pricey to get this stuff on your phone for $35, $50, $60, $70, or they are going to raise the price by $5. So now... The live a little package is going to be 40, just right is 55, go big is 65, and gotta have it is 75. So I just really think, guys, that this is, you know, this is really bad. You know, it's really, really bad that this company can just do this or whatever, you know, and I don't fault just Cricket, obviously, because Cricket is just basically just promoting it. It's not really a Cricket branded uh, thing, it's Direct TV, which is, falls under ATT. And it's just a really bad practice to just raise the price like that out of nowhere, no warning, no nothing, not giving anything extra, not saying that it's going to be like, ooh, you know, that we're going to give people more stuff or we're going to give them this or we're going to give them that. They're charging more for the same product or the same, you know, the same service, which is kind of ridiculous. And, you know, I don't see anybody doing DirecTV now, especially now. Ha ha ha, right? Uh, but yeah, so let me know what you think in the comments below. I think it's just a shady practice, to be honest with you. Uh, especially when companies charge more and they don't even give you more. Or they don't even give you the illusion of giving you more. Like They just don't care. They're just like, well, we're going to charge $5 more just because, you know? And it's like, well, tough cookies, you know? And they don't even, like, they're not even, like... I don't know. It's just, it's just like, well, it's just going to be charged next month, the, the customers or whatever, and, you know, they're going to be charged $5 more starting next month, you know, and it's because they can just leave if they want to, I guess, that, you know, they think it's okay. So we need to start voting with our wallets, guys, and, you know, fight back against this this stuff that, that, that these companies just think they can do. So anyways, like I said... Leave me in the comments below what you guys think, and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. You guys have a wonderful day. Peace out.